Anyway. This is fucking red lights all over again. What the fuck? Oh, Jesus Christ. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another reaction. This is unplanned. I was just scrolling through YouTube, trying to find something to watch while I eat my food, because it's impossible to eat unless you have something to watch. You know. And suddenly, Stray Kids' Maxident trailer comes out. And, uh, safe to say, I dropped everything and, uh, pressed record. So, let's, let's get into it. We got some bad boys on our hands. Ooh. Nice transition. Oh, that's cool. Excuse me? What? The f Fuck did you do, Hyunjin? What is up with those arms? I'm just trying to chill here and he comes at me like that. Keep those fucking arms to yourself. I get that you're playing bad boys right now, but keep those guns to yourself. What the f <laughs> What the fuck was that? I I got jack shit. Let's take this back. This concept. First of all, they look obviously freaking phenomenal. All of them. I am at a loss for words right now. So the budget, the production here, especially that fucking toy, the giant heart, eight letters is all it, is all it takes or something. It's maxident is obviously like maximum wreckage like an accident that is all the way up to the max so it's like creating as much damage in this accident or incident i'm seeing some of the comments here and some people are mentioning that this was shot in new york during their uh their tour or something or something in the states that it was shot during their tour which makes a lot of sense because it definitely looks very different the overall vibe here is absolutely, is absolutely insane. Let's take this back because I, I have nothing else to say. Of 
for one Broadway. Okay. They all look amazing, but um I, I feel like saying hola papi, but you know. Anyway. This is fucking red lights all over again. What the fuck? Oh Jesus Christ. Interesting, there's actual sound of thunderstorm and rain. There's a black umbrella, but obviously it's sunshine, so it sounds like in their heads could this uh, like the sound of madness the sound of rain and thunderstorm kind of like represent uh darkness and and, and maybe depression obviously he, the shot here just they're being a bunch of anarchists almost in a way they're just in this shot too like wreaking havoc uh pretty much this, this is a really cool symbolic shot if, if it means what i think it means That just means that he is eating the, the nicest part of the cone, which has the chocolate in it, so. I'm not hungry at all, no. Ah, oh, Jesus. I love how it, how the music, it's like... The equivalent of taking off your headphones and as you take them, suddenly the sound cuts out to create that effect. So here it's almost like he uh, changes his focus onto the, the lens or to us, perhaps, as then we move on to the sound effects of uh, the train and whatnot. Lucky Charms, interesting. Him looking... Him looking at... At the, the, the lens... Uh, is, I'm not sure if it's like trying to break away from social media because he's always stuck to his phone, perhaps. Dude. Let's... Seven, five, oh, six. Well, that doesn't really tell me much. I was hoping it would. Damn, this is so bouncy. Damn, don't. The scene with the toy car driving into the wall of cans kind of reminded me of uh, yesterday's uh, Bang Chan's uh, reaction to Pink Venom, where we have a similar thing happening in the actual music video with the car charging at the wall, the 4x4 breaking through the wall. Obviously not related, this was probably shot before, uh, but uh, cool little parallel, I guess. Ooh. These shots are... Some of the masking there and like uh, the, the... Oh my god, this is just... This was fucking beautiful. Like the, the production here is really... Like it's so different from the ordinary trailer, but it is just so bouncy. Red lights, Jesus. Could that have been like a little throwback to that, perhaps? Also, with them on that structure, it's almost like they're coloring outside the lines, if that makes any sense. I, I'm, 
I'm making this shit up as I go, because literally this trailer was just dropped. I just discovered it five minutes prior to recording this reaction. Very cool, by the way. Uh, touch on the chemistry with Yunjin and uh, Felix, obviously, as well as with the rings in Ordinary. But the scenes with the structure and them kind of almost as if like going outside of the lines like coloring outside the lines kind of breaking the rules which literally they are this trailer and this this album is going to be called maxident he's literally paint, painting across Wasn't there a f similar thing in Freeze, only with a real gun? Very interesting. Hello, Stray Kid. This is Ren. I want to send a call to your room. A letter to Holy K. One of the hearts is locked and it's also busted up. So it's like been through some shit and it's also the biggest one. There's a bunch of... One heart has a fucking dynamite stick or something. One heart is very sad. One heart has a bunch of uh, love uh, hearts around it. And clearly the, the Stray Kids members are kind of surprised. And possibly... Although some of them seem like it's just another Tuesday. Well, the other ones on the left side of the screen seem very confused to say the least i would be too maybe while being in the states they took some shit that they weren't supposed to take so you know <laughs> and he winked and there's a bunch of almost like evidence like after an accident holy shit th this is quite interesting this shot alone like the teddy bear which was featured with uh sung min I apologize for butchering uh, the names here, but the bicycle, the, the skateboard, which was broken, what looks like paint cans and brushes. There's a bunch of what looks like, kind of looks like cigarettes, but maybe those are like uh, the lollipops that uh, were in uh, Felix's mouth, perhaps. There is the umbrella, obviously. Because it was r raining uh, sound-wise, but it was a very sunny day. Maybe the 10 evidence, uh, 10 items of evidence, uh, 10 hearts. So maybe it means that there's going to be 10 uh, tracks in this album. No, there's 11. There's an 11th evidence. So were there more hearts? I'm not really sure, but the skateboard is broken in two and it's, it's registered as two different evidence. So maybe... I'm pretty sure I counted 10 hearts, if I'm not mistaken. 11 pieces of evidence, but one piece of evidence was broken into two pieces. So maybe it's like a part one and two, perhaps. I'm, I'm not really sure, but I don't know what to make of this. Jesus. Clearly, the ending is like the evidence of this accident that happened. Like this absolute wreckage. Is this a heart? Does he... It's not locked. It's it actually it. We don't see a lock. It looks more more like a chain, like a necklace of sorts, which is very interesting. It's like behind the bad boy image. There's there's a big heart, perhaps, and that's what this album is kind of gonna try to show in terms of showing a different side to Stray Kids, a little bit more rebellious, maybe a little bit more. Uh, aggressive but some of the hearts are very gentle as well some of the hearts are very cool like the one with the sunglasses as well is is very interesting so i feel like each heart if it actually is an, an indication of what the songs are going to sound like i feel like we're, we're in for for a for a roller coaster to be honest like and the heart is busted up but it still has a chain it's it, it's it's winking. I'm not. I'm not really sure what to make of this. This, I. I don't know, guys. I really don't know. I'm gonna follow this up in the next Stray Kids reaction whenever 
the comeback uh, is happening, the music video is happening, and we'll talk a little bit more about this because a lot more will come to light as well as Twitter, I'm sure, will, will come to the rescue because I definitely need a couple of pointers here, but there are a couple of things that relate to previous music videos like Freeze, like red lights, like the high buildings and everything kind of remind me of Maniac as well. The Lucky Charms is also very interesting because like the, those hearts are, are like giant Lucky Charms. I don't know. I'm, I'm so... I'm sorry, guys, but I don't know. I really don't. Uh, plus, I, I, I feel attacked by some of these visuals. That is not something that I thought that I would be saying ever about a boy group. J just like everyone else who I'm guessing watched this for the first and second and ten fucking times. Uh, the only thing that I can say is uh, 